What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Chef B. Starb. And listen, I'm doing something real simple. I was about to cook breakfast, and I'm about to do some fried potatoes. I'm about to um, fry some apples. I'm going to do a Cap'n Crunch French toast that I got from uh, the Blue Moon Cafe in Baltimore. But, you know, sometimes you can just think that this stuff is just easy stuff um, and not really think that people really do want to know how to do it. So I'm about to show you how to fry potatoes real quick. I got about, let's say about a quarter cup of um, bacon grease. So I, what I do is when I cook my bacon, I then reserve it and then I use it for later. So right now the bacon grease is hot and popping. Uh, the way you know it, you're going to hear this little sizzle when I put this uh, potato in it. You hear that? That's how we know it's rocking. I got three potatoes peeled, diced, chopped in uh, sliced in quarters. So I put in about half of those. I got an onion. I take about half of that. Go ahead and sprinkle it in there. I like the layer of my potatoes. You know what I mean? Give them the onion with the potatoes. Then we're gonna come back with that with the potatoes again. Woo, you hear that sound right there? That's what we call the sound of goodness. Okay, that's what we call that right there. So I'll put the rest of the potatoes in. You hear them, they just, now listen, the key for me when I fry potatoes, and everybody, there's so many different ways to fry potatoes. I learned this from my mom, you know, Reverend Dr. Nancy Lee, that's my mom. So everything I've done, I didn't have, I haven't been to chef school, and I, I honestly would love to go. But you know, I learned all this from sitting under my mama and my grandmama, watching them do their thing, and then now I'm doing my thing. So the key to, to this now, put the onions back on top. So once again, we layer, layer, right? So we got the potatoes, onions, some more potatoes, some more onions. Then I'm gonna go ahead and season it. Now, I usually go to the, the, uh, the Dutch market and I go and get all kinds of seasonings. It's usually in little containers like this. Uh, this right here is some good sea salt. So I'm gonna get that rocking. Now listen, I cannot tell y'all the percentage to put in. I can't tell you tablespoons or, or cups, half cup. I can't do that when I'm seasoning. For me, it's, it's I don't wanna say, I can't say that, but uh, I'll just say it's, it, it's, it's, a, it's a passion. And it's just kinda knowing what to put in, uh, when you need to put it in. You know what I mean? And, and just kind of moving from there. So we got the sea salt in there. Got some some pepper. Now, I love this pepper. It's ground black pepper, but it's kind of still got some um, some substance to it. So it's not all the way ground. So we got the pepper in there. Y'all see me. I'm heavy on it. <laughs> you see me. Now listen, this is one of my favorite little seasonings uh, from uh, Badia Complete Seasoning. A Sazon Complita. Sazon completa. Okay. We throw that in there too. I'm just, just layering it. Then uh, I like a little spice. So we got the red hot uh, crushed red peppers. Bat, 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 bat. Right? Right there. Um, and then, now, this is me. I, I like a little, a little, my fried potato. I like a little with that, the onion and, and the red pepper and that heat. I like a little sweet. So I usually take this. This is the only thing I'm going to say. I'll tell you about a tasteful now. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> we dropped a little bit. <laughs> but a little bit of sugar. That's just back. All right. Bang. On the sugar. All right. Now you hear that? That's not Rice Krispies. All right. That's not, that's not crack uh, and pop or whatever thing is. You know what I'm saying? But that is just the sound of it creating of brownness underneath. So what I want to do is I'm going to let that get brown underneath. Maybe about three to five, five minutes. And it creates like a crust. And then I go in with my spoon and I mix the seasonings and everything all together. And then we let it do it again. So that's pretty much it, y'all. It's really that simple. You're talking about maybe 15 or 20 minutes um, and you'll have like some of the best potatoes in the world. People will be ranting and raving over these That's it. It was that simple. Potatoes, onions, bacon grease. You got the black pepper, red bell pepper, sazon completa, uh, and a 
tablespoon of sugar. And I'm going to go down here and uh, grab a good old faithful right here. Uh, that is called the spoon. And so you just hear it. It's just, that's that's singing right there. Oh, you can smell, can you, can you smell what the rock is cooking? Lord Jesus. And we just going to let that do what it do, y'all. And uh, like I said, three to five minutes, it's going to create that crust. Um, matter of fact, let me let me show you what I mean. Let me let me can we it's just gonna get a little brown. See that brown? See those brown potatoes right there? See that? That's what's going on on the bottom. And so now we do that stir. Woo! Yes. The biggest thing is make sure you start off with a good amount of oil in there. Because you don't want it to dry out. Uh, if it does start drying out, just take some oil and just put it in there and let it kind of seep to the bottom and then keep cooking. So I just did that one stir. I'm going to leave them alone. I'm going to leave them alone for another three, three to five minutes, and then I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do that for like 20 minutes, and uh, then I'm just going to keep messing with it. And I'm going to have pictures on Bill Lee 23. Go to my Instagram if you want to see the pictures, the end result of what we did here on Instagram. Bill, B-I-L-L. L-E-E -E 23. Bill Lee 23. It's your boy Chef B. Starving, man. We just doing a little something for you. Because you may not have known how to fry potatoes. You know how to fry potatoes now. And yes, you do. Why you know how to do it? Because the big man went over here. What he doing? When you be starving, he ain't just eating. Big man was showing you how to cook too. Deuces.